Hey guys, it's Samara and today we are going to be doing a mukbang. I'm literally starving, haven't eaten all day. It's freaking three o'clock or some shit. I am ready to eat. I made some spicy noodles, um, Nikocado Avocado. He eats these and they look so delicious. So we're going to try them today. I don't like my noodles really, like I don't like ramen noodles with all that soup and stuff. I don't like that. So I drained it all out. Sorry if that's weird, but that's how I eat them. Okay, so so you guys, today I'm going to tell the story about when my friends brought me to a trap house unknowingly. and my friends were like it was a snowy ass day I was 20 um which is still a long time ago <laughs> you guys I'm getting old Anyway, it's a snowy ass day. It's like, I want to say like January or February. So it's like deep into winter here. And it was really snowy. Anyway, some of my friends were like, hey, let's hang out. We weren't old enough to drink yet. So like the cool thing back then was to like, get in your cars, cruise 8th Street, you know, flirt, talk with people, like race your cars. We're, this town is, has nothing to do, so that's what we did. Or we'd hang out at this like weird parking lot. It was like a parking lot and all the kids used to just go there and hang out or like hang out at Canyon Lake. Did anyone hang out at Canyon Lake? That was my, that was my spot. I loved Canyon Lake. Yes, yes. Anyway. So, my friends, some of my friends are like, hey, do you want to hang out? Blah, blah. It's like, yeah. Totally, I'm bored. There's nothing to do. It's a snowy ass night. It's like probably like 9.30 or 10 o'clock. And we all meet, we all meet at Walmart and we were taking my one friend's car because she had four wheel drive. So it was like safer than my Nissan. Anyway, why do I keep putting it way over there? Screw it. Oh, I'm drinking Mountain Dew, by the way, Diet Mountain Dew. A lot of people hate diet soda, but I love it. Anyway, so we get in my friend's car. We'll call her, we'll call her Tony because I didn't have any Tony friends. Um, so we got in Tony's car and she was, we were just going to drive around or whatever. Well, then they're like, hey, like, let's. Let's go. Um. To this one guy's house and like I want to pick something up from him I was like okay I'm down for an adventure and I was like where is this like who is it like you know Oh, he's uh, just some guy I get stuff from. And I was like, oh, okay. I thought it was just going to be, you know, not what it was going to be. Anyway, so we get to where we're going. And I, like, look at the outside and I was like, there is no way 
I am not going in there. <laughs> there is no way I'm going in there. It just looked really terrifying. They both like make me think like it's okay. Like there's, it's not a big deal or whatever. So they convinced me to go inside. We go inside. And there's like, you like walked into like a side door and like, it was like there was a garage, a side door and on the front of the house, you know, but it wasn't big and long. It was like really tiny. And we went in the side door instead of the front door, which went down to like a cellar or like a basement or whatever and there's like just people standing around down there like doing drugs like like putting shit in their veins and stuff like it was really scary and I was just like ah what are we doing here um don't want to be here Oops. So I'm just like on my phone the whole time. I'm just like, let's hurry up. Like, let's go. Like, I don't want to be here. Uh, they did whatever they had to do. And it was taking kind of a long time. And I was like, um, I'm just going to go wait out in the car, you guys. Like, I was really scared. Like, it was really scary. So... I get ready to like leave and this guy made it like very apparent that I wasn't going to be leaving without them and he had a gun and I was like oh my lord Jesus not today please and I was just like okay I'm just I just have to stand here until they're done like I don't have a choice so I'm just on my phone and this guy's like why are you on your phone so much it's like because I don't want to be here well we think uh you should get off your phone I'm not about to argue with someone that has a weapon. I'm just not a superhero. I don't have any fighting skills. I am a weakling. I would, I would not win. So I'm not going to even try. So I got off my phone and I'm literally standing there, like just staring at the wall. I was so scared. And then finally they come back and we leave what felt like forever. Um, we go, um, we just left and we get in the car and I freaked out. I'm just like, how could you bring me to a place like that when you know that that shit is like, I'm not about that life. If that's what you want to do, that's cool. I personally... I'm just not about it. I just don't, I just don't want to be around it. It was so terrifying. So situations like that, like really scared me because like seeing people like that, like, uh, scary. But anyway, so I'm just like bitches bringing me someplace like that. You guys are stink. What the hell? Anyway, we end up going and getting my car. I was so mad I was just going to leave, like, not even hang out with them anymore for the rest of the night. But they convinced me, like, they convinced me to stay. So I stayed. And uh, I got over it. And we had a sleepover and... Like, literally, everything was, like, it was fine the next day. Like, it wasn't weird or anything. 
but I never went in any more houses with them bitches ever again. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. All these noodles. They're good. I know why Nikocado Avocado loves these. I love noodles, you guys. Mm. I've been craving noodles forever. I've been eating a very low carb, um, like very clean eating. And this is these are like my little treats, you know. I've been so sick. It's been, y'all. My this past month has been. I've been so sick. Uh, everyone in my house has been sick. My boo boo's been sick. Oh my lord, she has been so sick. But finally, I found a cure. The pharmacist at Walmart, she hooked it up. She, uh, she knew exactly what I needed. She helped me. It was great. And it's been working. And saved me so much money. Um, but we have been sick. The whole house has been sick. I had freaking pneumonia, walking pneumonia, and uh, the rhinovirus. It was, it was a great time. I don't know if you guys watch... Um, Tana Mojo, but I love her. She's hilarious. Murder. I have been so clumsy, you guys. I've been falling upstairs, <sighs> dropping everything. <sighs> but anyway, Tana Mojo, she's so funny. I bet she can fuck up some food. You know? She, oh, these noodles, see, clumsy. These noodles. Ugh, a water chestnut. Ugh. I don't like water chestnuts at all, but they're good for you. Maybe they're not. Mmm. Y'all, that was delicious. I'm really proud of myself. I didn't mess up the makeup too much. Thank you so much for watching. Sorry I'm not like super bubbly yet. I'm still congested and whatever. But had to come on here. Had to eat some food with you guys. I missed it. It was literally way too long. It was a whole week. I couldn't believe it. I'm so sorry. Um, but I was dying. So... Yeah, uh, let me know down below what you guys want to see me do next. If you want to see a makeup video or another mukbang and story time. And I will see you guys on Sunday. Bye. Delicious.